Grassi, Vital, Matthew, Williams, and Kelsey, the starting five for the Beacons. And we are underway left to right on your screen. As there's the entry down low to Nakira Exumon, blocked on the way up Monday at NCAA headquarters in Indianapolis. And there's another entry pass to Nakira Exumon. He throws off to the left side for Vital. It's all good. Switch up on Houlihan. Gets to an open shooter, and it's up and good, and the Beacons are on the board. For three-year career at UMass Dartmouth. Kelsey puts the floor, bounces across the lane, and the shot's good. Good feed across the lane, and UMass Boston is still looking to take its first lead of the game. Good entry pass to Grossi. She shoots right through Lauren Empey and scores. MD. As Matt Dushaw will try again to find somebody that can be a spark plug for the offense. Jumper from the free throw line, no good. Bossy goes back up and scores. It's it for Vital. Vital going on Brown, kicks to the corner. Four left to shoot. Beacons have to get something up. They do, and it goes. What a great take to the basket by Megan Dixon. Will drive to the baseline. Up and under, shot no good. An offensive rebound. Scored and one on the follow. Gianna Williams able to score. Ball out to the wing for Grassi, stepping in on Milligan, rises to pass to the backside, got an open shooter, it's Dixon, she's hot, no good. Rebound Grassi, goes up and scores again. Dribbles into the lane, muscles through the lane, strip, can't get a call, of course there's fortunate not to get a reach in foul there on Exima. Dixon ahead of the defense, lays it up, what a shot. Dixon out to the left side, Vital's going to try a three, no good off the back rim, rebound, Dixon came loose with it and scores. Dixon, three on the shot clock, needs to get something off, passes long to it, the buzzer is good. Now with seven, deep three-pointer, in! Jackson hit that one from Fall River, and it's a 12-point lead for the Beacons at halftime. Stoppage and play. Houlihan, great pass across the lane to Dowdy, throws it up and gets it to go. 5.33 left in the quarter. Vital looking for a pass, goes up high to Osborne. Grassi going to try for the answer, and she's got it! Jackson, Bob entry, caught by Williams, makes the backside pass, back up top for Kelsey, nobody wants to shoot right now. Three from the corner is up and good. Matthew wanted to shoot, the seniors got three more. 17 to shoot. Bounce entry for Exumon. She's got an army around her. Kick out Dowdy. Wide open for three. Bang! Cuts it in half. Jackson. Up ahead for Williams. Williams dribbles in. Give me a whistle. Two points instead. Brown. Steps in. Her pass is tipped. She gets it back. Stays in bounds. Somehow to reverses it and scores. Dance on the line. Brown. Bounce entry down low for Exumon. Osborne back out there. Nakira scores anyway. And here she comes. Dribbles into the front court. Her pass stolen away. Chance to get a freebie back the other way. Dowdy racing back to bother it, but it's good. Trying to retake the lead. Dowdy left open, wants the three. Bang! Four away from throwing this thing in cruise control. Amazing how this is turned. Grassi catches and scores. Taken by Brown. Brown kicks it back to Houlihan on the baseline. Passes to Exumon. Exumon goes up and finishes. Took him up on it, but missed the shot. And now the Beacons will get a chance to tie. There's Osborne. In the lead, throws it up and gets it to go, and we've got a tie game. They could have bet on before it got going, but here we are. Five to shoot, long pass caught by Grossi, and she scores again. Brown bounces inside, nearly a steal, and it is stolen and brought into the front court. UMass Dartmouth hoping for a better fate here in 2018, but it just was not meant to be here today. As the Kira Exumon fouled out, and that ended everything. Final score in Dartmouth, the UMass Boston Beacon 65, the UMass Dartmouth Corsairs 56. The Beacons win this battle of the University of Massachusetts system, and they win the 2018 Little East Conference Tournament Championship. They get the first Little East Tournament Championship in the history of their program, and they will go to the NCAA Tournament in style via automatic qualification for the first time in program history, and they've also secured their first 25-win season in program history. Outstanding player and deservedly so put the team on her back in the first quarter.